Welcome back. This is going to be my daily forecast for the indices for Monday, March the 21st, 2022. If you like support the channel, you're going to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button, the bell button to see our newest videos. And uh, let's start by looking at the S&P 500. So we had an absolutely amazing uh, week last week. From Tuesday all the way to Friday, this market just rallied roughly 6.56% to the upside. At this current stage, we're hovering just underneath the 200 moving average. We have broken through the 50 moving average. And uh, yes, this was quite unexpected. Um, expectation was actually that this was going to pull back. But as you can see, there is almost no pullback at the end of uh, the session on Friday, neither on Tuesday, Wednesday, uh, Thursday or Friday. And uh, as long as that is the case, then this market uh, looks like it's ready to uh, go to the upside. But still, there's uh, a resistance above and um, should basically take this a grain of salt, this rally here, because economically, there is absolutely nothing that supports this rally at this current stage. The Fed is increasing interest rates. Uh, economic outlook is not good for the world economy. And there's a war of Europe. So uh, some bad news could basically topple this uh, rally here quite quickly because we did see one right here. We did also see one right here and then it just crashed. So, so there's a lot of volatility. This rally was kind of expected because everything was so oversold. So I'm not going to jump in right yet. But if you look at technical indicators, we can see the MACD is, is bullish at this current stage. RSI is bullish. So is the CCI. So is the stochastic. But we are basically at the top here of the Bullinger Band. So we could see a pullback to the middle of the Bullinger Band before continuing up. And that's basically a pullback of roughly... Um, towards uh, 4,300. So if you look at the Nasdaq, we can see we have also rallied here quite nicely, roughly roughly 10% to the upside uh, in just the four days. That ad is absolutely amazing. But we're hovering just underneath the 50 moving average, have not broken through uh, the 50 moving average and also the 300 moving average right above. MACD is bullish, RSI is bullish, CCI is bullish as well. So all technical indicators are basically pointing uh, that basically momentum is to the upside. We are technically in a downtrend and these rallies are expected. For example, this one was also an amazing rally of roughly, roughly 10%. This one was also a rally of right 8.7%. So we have seen these rallies uh, in basically this downtrend. And now we are basically testing the 50 moving average, but there's no pullback whatsoever at the Friday session. So people are basically buying into uh, the close of a Friday session. We are getting close to the top of the bullish band, and that usually means that we are going to see this pullback at some stage, probably tomorrow or or uh, on starting on Tuesday, Wednesday, this could tumble back towards the middle. And if we get some really bad news, then we could retest these lows. If we break these lows of roughly 13,000, then this market is going to tumble significantly further. So it is has been a really good pullback of roughly uh, 20%. And we haven't seen a pullback of that um, at that size for a really long time. Even the pullback here at the, or the crash of the in 2020 was roughly 30%. So this is only 10% away from this crash. But considering this massive move to the upside, this was always uh, expected to happen. So hope you help find this helpful. You're willing to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button, the bell button to see our newest videos. Good luck and thank you very much.